Notice Libertad selling my dividero to the Yankees? You're a dead man! When the Garillas arrested my family in 67, me, Papa, was dragged to this very cell. I was put in the cell next door. 13. Like you, mijo. We used to talk every single night through this vent. I loved it. His voice taught me to be strong, to be a man. And then the Garillas came every day under charge. Oh. Yeah. Crime by crime, piece by piece, he paid to the Garillas. But we would still talk every single night. Until they took his tongue for his lies to Yara. Stop! Papa, stop this! Who is this girl here to you? Ah, I think we should skip a few steps, Raul. Viva Libertad. The attack. The Hotel Paraiso. Danny was there. You... You told me that you hid in the tunnel. Danny could have killed me. Could have given me to Libertad. We have no time for lies. I've stopped running. I've listened. I've learned. I've done everything you have asked. I will be El Presidente. Let Danny go. I am not a monster, Diego. We will give them a chance. We're burned. Castillo was waiting. He and his fucking general tried to kill me. Glad you made it. I, uh, I have to ask. Did you talk, Danny? Not a fucking word. Once a guerrilla, always a guerrilla. The kid, Diego, he saved my life. What? Shot Anton's general dead. Old dog? Pinga. This is good. This is very good. We are playing 4D chess in space now, Danny. Fuck your 4D chess, Juan. I just got my molars ripped out. Same thing happened to me back in the Congo. Except I did it to myself. Just chew in the front, like a rabbit. And Juan, let's leave Clara out of it. We got burned. That's all she needs to know. Clara's got enough to fucking deal with, let alone you almost getting torn to pieces. Gracias. Big. 
What feels different? There's my baby tigre. Hey, I don't know. I'm here for Those medical supplies will put a lot of guerrillas back together. Gracias. Lucky appreciates them too. Even if she doesn't show it. And bringing La Morale was smart. This camp needs young blood. Shakes things up. Now we need to work on Lorenzo. Half the abuelos out there hang on his every word. Honron said Lorenzo should visit a BioVira facility. But getting Lorenzo to do anything is like pulling a tank through the mud, sideways. I'm going to give him a little reminder of what we stood for. And you are going to bring the BioVira to him. All you got to do is tiptoe in, take photographs of anything suspicious, and get out. For a so-called research facility, they have way more guns than lab coats down there. They're hiding something, baby Tigre, and we're going to slap Lorenzo in the face with whatever it is. Hope you have good camera skills. What do you kids say? No filter? I won't have a junkie in my camera.
think I'm going to be safe. Castillo, you fucking monster. I need more pigs. people. It's horrific. Oh, I believe it. But it's Lorenzo who needs convincing. And what about Gabriella? I don't know what to tell you. She's gone. Uh, I had a feeling. Okay. Get those photos back to camp. It's time for Lorenzo to wake up. We were just kids, El Tigre. <laughs> Lorenzo, I took pictures of that place Honron was talking about. You swipe to the left. They look free to you. Yeah. This is what Libertad and La Moral are fighting. You can hate us, but at least we're doing something about it. No one deserves this, Lorenzo. This is happening all over Yara. You just can't see it from so high up this mountain. I can't look at this anymore. I didn't vote for Castillo. The war is over. So that was a waste. That's the bien. Who shook the tree? We need them all. Dale. Hey, nice work with that rescue. I heard you keep No sign of trouble. What's happening? Meeting on the mound. Some of our friends want to quit early. Okay, listen up. This isn't worth killing for. Sure as hell isn't worth dying for. We're young. We should be out there drinking and fucking and skipping school. Woo! Our parents and grandparents already stole our future. Why should we give a shit? That's what I used to think. And then one day, Admiral Benitez walked into my classroom with a gun. She called on your name, you came to the front. One by one. Alvarez. Bermudez. Carrillo. The Admiral read their crimes. Protesting, handing out pamphlets, liking a Clara Garcia post. Fernandez, Jimenez, Peña. I learned a lesson on my last day at school. You can either be on the right side of history or the wrong side of Castillo's guns. Wise words, young Guerrilla. La Moral taking new members? Depends. What? Is there an age limit? I will bleed for La Moral if you take me. Welcome to the war, viejo. <laughs> so how do we take out the Admiral? Push-ups are the first step to victory. The Grand Hotel, Danny. That's the key. I got a convoy I like to make friends with. No. 
Neat, Carlito. Push-ups never lie. You just cut your hand open. You sure doing push-ups was such a good idea? What can I say? Your little speech puffed me up. See! The part where you put the gun to your oh, head and pull the trigger?